Dude's massive. Oh my god, this kid realistically has no chance. His foot is half the size of his body. Hi everyone and welcome to a new anime reaction series here on my channel. So today I am going to start watching Tower of God. So season one aired a couple of years ago I think now. So I am definitely a few years behind on this series but with season two releasing very very soon I decided I might as well jump in on it, watch season one just in time for season two to start airing and then continue the series from there. Now I don't know much about this series at all, pretty much just the bare minimum. Pretty much that we've got this main guy who is trying to climb the tower I think and at the tower you can have anything you want I'm pretty sure that's the premise of it it was a while ago that I did a little bit of research into this actually I didn't want to go too far into it and spoil myself so that's as much information as I currently have about this I am really excited to jump into the series though see where it goes and hopefully I'll like it enough to stick around for season two please don't forget to like subscribe if you haven't already to stay up to date with these videos comment and let me know your thoughts or what they were when you first watched these episodes now for those of you who are interested I do post uncut reactions and early access to this content over on my patreon you can find the link to that in my description so currently we are two weeks ahead let's get into the very first episode of Tower of God okay <laughs> monsters in this series I'm guessing This is a bit eerie already. Starting off strong. Okay, so they do have to climb the tower to get whatever they want. What is that? Okay, this seems really interesting. <laughs> wow, alrighty. So that's the main goal of the main guy. Oh. Oh girl. Oh, no, no. Bam and Rachel. Let's see how this goes. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So they've got to climb the tower to get whatever they want. I feel like there's, there's definitely competition, right? Are they like the people that we saw before as well? Are they all fighting to get to the top themselves? This is an interesting opening. Wait, should I be watching this? I don't know if I should be watching this, honestly. Might be some spoilers in it, you know? I'm gonna not watch it until you guys let me know whether it's safe or not to actually watch it. Is this Rachel or some other girl? Is that Bam or some other boy? <laughs> is she running away from him? Why? The animation style is very different to what I've seen. What's going on here? Is she ditching him for the tower? Wait, what? She'll be born again? What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> Damn. Okay, that's gotta hurt. So she's been transported to the tower area. Is that how it works? He's gonna join her though, right? Oh yeah, now he's going there. Oh well. Who is it? It's just like some protector of the yeah, caretaker of the tower. I'm betting this guy knows everything. So is he gonna climb the tower to find Rachel to get her back? But she's climbing for her other reasons. So not only do you have to climb a tower, you have to take a test first. A frightening test? What does he have to do? <laughs> oh god, alrighty. This is the first test. Oh 
He's going straight to it. He's running in. God, that eel's gonna be like horrific, isn't it? All right, not just yet. Wait your turn, I guess. Oh, are they going to work together? Princess? No, he's trying to get Rachel. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> this Evan dude, poor guy. <laughs> he's having a heart attack. Wow, she's really determined to help him, hey? Yes, he does. <laughs> She's just helping him out, okay? <laughs> yeah, sure. You hate being bored. What? What is it? Tell me! Oh, it's terrifying. What is he doing? Did he just get eaten on purpose? Surely not. He's gonna like cut his way out from the inside, right? Wouldn't you be scared of it like chomping you in half though? Oh. So did he know that or did he just falter for a moment and get eaten? Ooh, this dude. Is that him? Wait, what? Is he stuck down there or something? And Rachel saved him. What? Aww. No wonder he's so fond of her. She rescued him. Oh, wow. Stop. It's like Attack on Titan. I'm mean, like, I want to see the ocean. She's like, I want to see the stars. <laughs> Makes me depressed thinking about what's to come. Oh, is it gonna listen to him but not her? Oh damn, it works. How? Why? <laughs> what? Is he gonna help her find the stars? It's because you don't have a cute face, okay? Where did they go? To the... To the next floor. With her weapon? <sighs> she's gonna do it anyway. Yep, she's determined. Okay, so it seems like they are going to continue to be allies at least. Maybe for the time being. We'll see how things play out. Yeah, me too. Me too. He just wants to see her again. He doesn't care. <laughs> really? How long has it been? So is time working differently? How long has it been since she's seen him? Test 2. Okay, so each level poses a new threat, a new challenge. Oh. Alright. What's this one? What is this one? Wait, you have to kill? So this has turned into a bit of a battle royale? 
dude's massive. Oh my god, this kid realistically has no chance. His foot is half the size of his body. Oh my god. She's she's gonna aim for him. Get out, dude. Run, run, run. Oh my god. No, this is this is crazy. I thought this was going to be crazy, but I didn't like really think it would turn so quickly, you know. Oh no. Oh no, who is this guy? This guy's creepy. He's freaking me out. Oh no. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, um, there's, they're all there together. Did it just finish? No, oh my god. Tower of God seems like it is going to be a very interesting series and I can't wait to see more. So we have been introduced to quite a few characters who I believe we'll see a bit more of throughout the season. Yuri and Evan being two of them and I also think that the blue haired guy we saw at the end of this episode will also play a bit of a role in the future. I am anticipating that perhaps Ben won't actually get to see Rachel until probably near the end of the season because according to Ball Lady she has spent quite a lot of time apart from him but I don't think it's the same for him. It seemed like Rachel leaving and Bam being here in this episode happened all within the same day. I'm not entirely sure if that is correct if I got that right or whether time kind of works differently for people who are on the tower but if time has been working differently it does seem that Rachel is probably a lot further ahead than where Bam is at level two currently. So Bam has got a lot of catching up to do. I don't think it will take long at all for Yuri and Evan to catch up with Bam. I'm sure we'll see them very, very soon, perhaps in episode two or even the next one, but I am hoping that they are allies and they aren't forced to kind of turn on each other at all. I have a feeling we'll be seeing quite a lot of flashbacks between Bam and Rachel, just because Rachel currently isn't in the picture. So we will get to see through those flashbacks exactly what their relationship is, how it came to be. So they'll be nice to go into some depth with their story. Hearing Rachel's dreams of wanting to see the stars felt very similar to Armin's dreams of wanting to see the ocean and with that similar feeling obviously came the feeling of dread because we all know that although Armin's dreams did come to fruition it was also a major turning point for the story and especially for a certain character. So I'm hoping nothing dreadful is to come of Rachel seeing the stars but for now I do have a bit of a bad feeling about it just because of that comparison. Bam succeeding past the first test was fantastic. We obviously didn't hear his thought process at all so I honestly thought he just was too weak, too scared and just, I don't know, he just didn't know what to do so he ended up just getting swallowed by this eel. I do think that his character is going to be quite similar to Jin Woo from solo leveling just in the sense that he is weak at the beginning but I feel like with every level he passes he is going to grow stronger, more powerful, more confident and we'll really see that change in his character by the end of the season. This second level surprised me for sure. I was kind of expecting Battle Royale vibes just from the premise of this series, but the fact that the regulars were kind of just forced into the situation where they had to kill each other straight up threw me off. It wasn't just them kind of killing people who got in their way from completing a different task. They were actually forced and had to kill each other. So that was definitely surprising and the level of intensity in that scene was really high as well, especially when it panned from the guy who was trying to kill Bam, him being killed by the arrows and then it panned to the the archer chick and then she was shot dead so then we panned to the sniper guy and then the sniper guy was kind of just removed from the situation. I really enjoyed that sequence of events. Overall I enjoyed the episode. We got an explanation as to what exactly the tower is and why people are participating in this sort of fight to reach the top. We also got that insight into Bam's goals and his relationship with Rachel so those motivations are clear plus we obviously got a little bit of action so yeah it was great. I am hoping for a lot more action in the next episode though. Now I know it was probably a while ago now for a lot of people who have seen this series but I would love to hear what your thoughts were when you first watched this episode or what your overall thoughts on the whole season is. Just make sure they're spoiler free for now please. Also please let me know whether it is safe for me to watch the opening sequence because I have decided to just kind of ignore it for the time being to avoid any potential spoilers. So if someone could let me know whether it is safe to watch that 
That would be fantastic. Thank you for that. But thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you haven't already. Any support helps out my channel so much and I really appreciate it so, so much. Remember that I do post uncut reactions and early access to this content over on my Patreon. There are also a bunch of other series over there right now. Thanks again for watching though and I hope you'll stick around for future videos.